Hello, it's this Trey with a reading for the collective. Take what resonates out the rest. Study my morning coffee. I hope that everyone feels amazing. I appreciate all of your positive energy. Let's see what the primary energy is for the collective. Four of Cups. So someone might be feeling melancholy. Um, dissatisfied. Uh, just want to be left alone. Um, rejected. Maybe like the life is passing them by. Someone could just want their own space for a bit. Um, the problem is High Priestess. Maybe someone's feeling like they need time to think about this High Priestess or this High Priestess is taking some time to think. High Priestess, someone could feel rejected by someone who is very wise and intuitive. Um, someone could feel rejected by a High Priestess energy. Nine of Cups reverse. Some, some, someone's not happy. The Lovers, this could have to do with a couple or choice in love, someone choosing someone. Um, the Empress in the subconscious. Wow. It's interesting too because this High Priestess is looking down at this Empress. So it's like this intuitive person knows something about themselves. Being this Empress energy. Hmm. The world reverse. Something is unfinished here. Someone really loves someone. A King of Wands really loves someone. Somebody has overcome some type of heartache. There's a King of Pentacles involved as well. Someone here could feel very hopeless. Huh. This feels like a lot of energy to be projected at you or that you could be experiencing. This is a lot of heavy, this is a lot. Um, wow. Recent past is death. Something is over. We have four of pentacles and... Something about this king of wands. An ending, someone letting go of something connected to a king of wands. I feel like the way this grim reaper here is looking away from this Four of Cups, it's almost like I can almost hear, hear the activity. There's still a lot going on from this death here. There's still a lot happening in people's lives connected to this death card. There's a lot of people involved with whatever's going on here. So it's not as if this is over by any means. So, this is almost like, this is an elongating end, elongated ending, Four of Cups, something here is almost zeroing in or focusing on one person here, um, but there's a lot of people involved with this death card. Um, it has to do with someone's fate, or something that's fated, or something that is very Something is in alignment here. There's a grand design. There's good fortune, positive changes. And someone's feeling rejected. But we have this Five of Swords here also. So there is someone out that wants to win at all costs in the energy. So far what I'm getting is definitely be observant. I feel like... You could be picking up on, there's a lot going on energetically. 
there's could be someone's in a nightmare here or there could be some sort of anxiety um someone wants to come out of the cold there's something about someone recuperating from heartache healing i should say from heartache maybe recuperating as well some situation where there was a lot of overindulgence and now there's this new beginning here this ace of cups so there is a will of fortune there is an ace of cups there's this high priestess there's this empress energy so something's very positive but i feel like there's a lot of projection and we have that five of swords here but you know something about yourself. Deep down, you know something. And it's almost like someone here feels rejected by you or you want to be left alone for a moment. There's some Empress energy. You know that you're the one for someone or that Someone sees you as the one, or you're not going to make it easy for someone. You're not going to spell it out, but that doesn't sound right. It's that you can't, how can you clarify something like this for someone? Or how could you have in the past? Or... Or you know that someone sees you as the same percentage. I'm not sure yet. Let's keep going. Um, the lens that someone's looking through. Um, actually, sorry. Intentions, expectations. Seven of Cups. Someone has to figure out, figure out their options. Knight of Cups. In regards to their romantic feelings. And and work or group, group collaboration. Someone feels like they made a mistake here. A King of Cups. Um, and they could be trying to manifest something right now in regards to you. Or someone sees you as a manifester, this King of Cups, or this King of Cups is trying to manifest you. Someone is doing something in secret. An Emperor Reverse is doing something in secret. Yeah, the Moon, Seven of Swords, Emperor Reverse. Or someone's trying to hide something. But there is a King of Pentacles in the upright. There's, we saw a King of Cups. We saw a King of Pentacles. And we also saw a King of Wands all in the upright. So there, I feel like there could be three masculine energies in the upright involved here. Um, Seven of Cups. This Empress energy could also represent a mother figure in the subconscious. Someone could be hiding their romantic feelings from a, from a group, Three of Pentacles, but this group is all doing something, planning something, collaborating, doing something here. Ten of Cups, there's a lot of love, unconditional love. Someone is thinking deeply about this. There's some sort of like a relationship or a Two of Cups here. Um near future ace of cups wow new love new beginning self-love joy and then temperance reverse under the deck so it's like somebody i feel like there's someone obviously observing or on the outside because there's Positivity here, but it's like some something is off here for someone temperance reverse Maybe someone can't heal or something is very in bad. There's no balance 
Someone could be emotionally off balance. Someone could be drinking a lot. You know, someone could be swinging wildly from one thing to another, or this is just energy is off for someone. Um, Six of Pentacles, it feels like you're getting what you deserve. Um, or you, yeah, Knight of Pentacles, there's some sort of commitment here. Long-term commitment. Um, this could be work, romance. And, and it's bad news for someone else. So this kind of keeps coming up. The lens that someone's looking through for the collective. Appreciate you all very much, by the way. Uh, the moon. Someone could feel very unclear about something here. Or someone's trying to hide something. Hierophant reverse. Four of swords. Someone's thinking deeply about something. A message. Maybe messages. Four of swords. Someone. Hierophant reverse. The moon. Someone is... Unclear. The lovers, it has to do with a couple, a choice in love. Something is hidden. Someone making something right or fair for someone. Eight of Wands, some sort of message. Messages, vibrations, energy, the wheel of fortune, things are going well. well. Something's faded, something is aligned something is good good fortune good karma okay there's a lot of people involved i feel like <clears throat> and a lot of projection there's positive energy unfolding around you and then you have all of this hidden intensity um and it feels like a gaze on you more than one. Um, actually, this Hierophant reverse, this could be a group of people. Eight of Wands, something about maybe a group of people all reading or even watching something. Eight of Wands, or something about messages or group messages, maybe. Eight of Wands. Correspondence. Or something to do with someone falling in love, even. Or something happening online. The moon. Maybe someone feels confused by something happening online. Or someone's trying to hide something online. Maybe someone's getting a divorce and they're trying to hide it. Or, so, or someone's unclear about a marriage. They don't know what's going on. Let's see here. Um, hopes. Oh, sorry. In the environment. Wow. Ten of Swords. So there's some sort of betrayal that hurts. Or some sort of crushing ending, which I feel like could be... It's echoing. That's the word. There's like echoes of this. Death in the recent past. It's still echoing into... And it feels like multiple people. There's a lot of endings here. And it's the echoes of this are kind of flowing into the present tense here. And I could see that too with this Ten of Swords in the environment. Strength reverse. There could be some sort of an ego death here. Um, someone who was in their ego could feel betrayed. The lovers. It has to do with a choice in love. Ten of Swords. Someone's in their ego about someone's choice in love. Ten of Swords. Someone feels betrayed. Something is working out for someone. Will of Fortune. Someone's focused on someone's good fortune. Someone's fate. And they feel crushed. 
and the environment. There's a king of wands involved. Hmm. Uh, hopes and fears. Four of Pentacles reverse. Someone has to let go of something. That's what some, or someone's hoping someone will let go, or someone is only cares about money and power. So, or someone doesn't feel like some situation is very secure. Page of Swords reverse. This is gossip, spying, slander connected to this Four of Pentacles. Okay, so we have the, someone slandering someone, Six of Cups, someone from the past where there's unconditional love, some sort of nostalgia, memories, sweet memories, or a soulmate connection that feels like someone's known someone forever with a King of Pentacles. Um, someone's real nervous about this. There's a King of Wands and a King of Pentacles here. I don't know who the King of Cups is. Maybe it's representing feelings or actions or someone being being um, a loving masculine energy that's emotionally balanced, um, a spouse, a partner, a good partner. Um, outcome, Knight of Cups. Someone has romantic feelings for someone. Someone is maybe giving someone some flowers or sharing their romantic feelings or um, wants to take someone on a date or two people are in some sort of situation where someone really feels romantically um, inspired by someone. This could be also a congenial offer. Someone could be expressing their feelings. Romance is in the air here. Wow, we have the chariot under the deck. King of Wands. Wow. It's about getting control of a situation, a king of wands getting control or having control over a situation. This got to do with travel as well. Someone heading towards someone, someone living balanced in a balanced way. There's something about this king of wands that's very significant. masculine energies a king of wands a king of pentacles and then you've also got this like slander slanderer someone's hiding something someone is crushed someone here could be religious um someone could have some sort of addictive patterns that they're dealing with in this situation. Someone here thought they were, they were, you know, they felt more invincible than, than they are uh, in a situation. If, yeah, this, this bully. The bully is not happy. Some sort of Bullying didn't work. Wow. Saboteur reverse. It's not working. So I guess that's who's crushed. Yeah, this vampire. This vampire thief. Um, who thought, I feel like they thought you were easy. This. Sorry about that interruption. Someone, something about holding on to someone's money. 
um, or think feeling like invincible around money or money making someone feel invincible a bully saboteur thief vampire that's what you got here versus this visionary virgin <laughs> someone who's very um, pure at heart pure of heart yeah versus this hedonistic queen reverse uh, so the comparison, there's a comparison here. Um, somebody here who is very controlling and demanding and selfish. I feel like someone also who um, likes to indulge a lot. With someone who's trying to steal something from you. Someone who's very um, much an energy vampire. Someone that was trying to sabotage you. A bully. A bully, a bully who just cares about money. Um, but there is this romantic energy around you. Um, yeah. Child divine, child magical, god, healer, storyteller. You're very got very beautiful energy. I feel like somebody sees that. Lover. Wow. Angel goddess. Mentor. Somebody really, um, I feel like someone sees what someone was trying to do here. This femme fatale reverse trying to destroy you. I feel like someone knows knows this or sees this. Or someone wanted to destroy this for you. I feel like there could be someone new here with this mentor energy. I feel like this got this has to do with something that you you see, you see. Visionary, this could be like this high priestess energy. You're very intuitive, or this has to do with your ideas, your creativity, um, the way you approach business or your job. Hmm. So someone here is feeling rejected, or they just want to be left alone. This could even be you, because there's so much energy being projected at you. But I feel like this is someone else. Moon in Cancer. Venus, Scorpio, Venus and Scorpio. Pisces, Sun and Gemini, Sun and Capricorn. <clears throat> Cancer. Um, I think I said Scorpio. Okay, so occupation, lovers, message. I feel like that's what it keeps coming down to. Some type of eight of wands, some sort of message, something about a couple and someone's job or work or business. A choice in love, a contract in regard, a message about a contract, a message about a choice in love. Someone's feeling rejected, or someone... I feel like you're not seeing what's going on here. You're looking at something else. Child reverse. and horizons journey this could be a path that someone's take someone took this could have to do with somebody's life path life journey courting someone something about someone courting someone someone taking a trip somebody's courting someone on a trip Courtship journey. 
something happening online, or this is a message about a courtship. It's child reverse, um, thief reverse. Someone's not innocent who was trying to make themselves out to be innocent. Or someone was trying to use a child in a situation. Some sort of message. Some sort of message is very important here. Someone could feel trapped. Um, high Priestess. Why is the High Priestess in the challenge position? High on a reverse. Someone has fallen from grace in your eyes. Or you see or you saw that someone was dishonorable. Someone's in bad health. You have a gift to offer. You're gifted. You uh, were a gift. You are this Empress energy. This mature man. There's a man, a masculine energy here. There's another masculine energy involved that's in the reverse. Someone did something dishonorable. Someone doesn't belong here. Somebody could have tried to say you don't belong here. Or someone else is... Someone did something dishonorable. Someone else doesn't belong here. Maybe someone chose someone. Because uh, this is about a choice and love. It's the, the... You're the Empress energy deep down. That's what's in someone's subconscious. It's like you've known something or you know something. You've known something this whole time. Um, Empress in the subconscious. Expectation. Yeah, there's some type of... This could also have to do with pregnancy. Someone could have given a false person a gift. Someone that's not an Empress energy. Privileged lady. Gift. Someone could have given all their time and love and energy to someone else that's false, that doesn't belong here. Um, the, the gift belongs with you or someone is gifting you something, or someone sees you as the blessing, as the gift, you're the one that's supposed to receive the, the offer, um, the offers, the stability. Someone was very dishonorable with you, towards you. Hmm. There's a great fortune here. Maybe you know something, um, you definitely know something. Great fortune, privileged lady, gift. I feel like someone definitely gave something to the wrong person for sure. And there's something coming to light here though about you being being a blessing a real blessing in someone's li life you're gifted you have a gift you're a blessing um there's you deserve the best here um, someone did something very dishonorable but you saw something the whole time there's some sort of expectations around you being this empress energy Privileged lady, great fortune. It's like you're very well rounded. You you have respect, or there's some you know empress energy expectation. Deep down, someone feels like it's respect, it's honor, but also blessings. Or something that's faded or that you, to be this Empress energy, you would have had to have really gone through a lot to be on this throne. It's not superficial. And this, there could be also something to do with childhood as well. Or a child. Expectations around motherhood. Um, or, or mothering as well. Um, death in the recent 
past or someone feels deep down like someone's pregnant could be that as well recent past death pathway i'll just take it something's over someone's pathway is blocked it could have to do with a marriage someone's in bad health over a marriage or a couple something happening online or something that someone feels about you you being in the upright This could have been someone who um, walked away and you're moving on. Um, it could be that you're in um, something new and that this person feels it. And maybe your energy has been with them this whole time. Maybe whether you realize it or don't. Because you've been maybe healing or single or, or focused on other things. Um, but if there's someone else there, someone could be picking up on it and it could be some type of, um, it could be jolting for someone if, if they were not acknowledging what you meant to them, someone could have, you know, compartmentalized their feelings. Um, seven of cups, someone is trying to figure out their options. Thief reverse. A thief could be trying to figure out their options or, um, Someone could be trying to figure out if someone's, someone's a thief or not. Someone could be trying to figure out if somebody is um, going to try to take everything from them. So they've got to figure out their options, how to leave. Or this thief is, is trying to figure out their options because they weren't able to steal something. There could be a problem with a child. There could be someone taking care of a child that's not theirs. This child could be, um, you know, a, a special needs child. Um, there's a, definitely a problem with the whole group of people. Someone doesn't belong here. Someone's a false person. Someone doesn't belong here. You belong here. Yeah. Something seems clear as day. But there's also this new beginning and there's more than one masculine energy. You have a gift. Someone didn't message you. Someone's not messaging you. Someone doesn't like the message they're hearing. Some sort of bad news. Something could be deeply concerning. Someone could go to jail. Or someone trapped themselves. Ace of Cups in the near future. You love yourself. Um, there's a new beginning here. Joy. Distant horizons. Someone could be picking up the energy, reading the energy. It's going to be happening online. There's change coming. This could have to do with a trip as well. Um, someone could be... Didn't, isn't putting the work in, didn't put the work in, they're in bad health. These changes are coming. This change is here. Someone is not well. They can't work. Could po possibly someone can't work. This mature man is not a wealthy man, or this wealthy man and this mature man are splitting. Someone could be looking at something almost as if it's biblical in connection to you. As far as your knowledge, your energy, you being this pure spirited person with a lot of positive energy and good karma. Um, and the abundance that's connected to something that's faded as far as um, choice in love, choice in alliances. Someone could be seeing it from a biblical perspective in regards to you. Like what is anointed, anointed, yeah. Um, the moon, somebody, someone is very either unclear or they're trying to hide something. 
the moon. Um, official person reverse. Someone does not belong here. Someone doesn't belong here. Wealthy man reverse. Someone courtship. Someone's courting someone. And someone could feel like they've, they're losing everything. They lost everything. Or someone is trying to hide. Someone lost everything and they're courting you. Or they're courting someone here that's not wealthy. Is courting you. Or someone that is... Feels like they're losing everything and you're being courted. Battery went out. There's some sort of a message. That's what's important here. And it feels like someone feels like someone's an imposter. Someone wants to message you. They see you in the upright. Lovers. A message about lovers. A message to you about being in a connection. Um... Yeah. Someone could be in despair about this message. About this journey. About taking this trip. To your house. To your business. Lovers. Or someone coming to your house. Being, being in a relationship with you. This great fortune. There's some sort of a great fortune here. Connected to you. Mature woman. Something could be... It's subjective. Great fortune is subjective. But someone could feel like aligning themselves with you is where all the blessings um, come from. And that they've chosen some sort of false person um, who maybe did something here with some type of paperwork or formality or there's some type of legal issue that that can't be that is difficult to fix ten of swords someone here is um crushed in the environment someone feels defeated everyone can see what's happening to family room, room reverse something that maybe was an intimate secret between a few people is coming out in the environment everyone knows what the problem is. Everyone can see something. Wealthy man reverse. Someone lost all their money or they've lost a connection with a masculine energy that is, um, was an integral part to someone's business or, um, this could be something about someone dating someone that's not wealthy and it's clearing up something about your priorities. Maybe that you're not concerned about whether someone has money or doesn't, or what their position is. Lovers. Um, something could be getting clarified. If someone tried to say you're a gold digger, this could be clarifying something. Yeah, someone is a false person here. It's not you. Someone could have aligned themselves with someone that's false in a relationship. And lost all their money. False person lovers. This could be an ex that was um, hiding their feelings for you and isn't doing well financially. There's something about a marriage here. I don't know if someone wants to marry you or if you're in some sort of high level, some sort of commitment that seems like it's heading towards marriage. Lovers. Yeah, there's something about a relationship here for sure. And it's in the upright. I feel like it's a choice in love tor towards you. But the thing is, it seems like there's a king of pentacles and a king of wands here. It's almost like you're not even paying attention, though, to something that could be coming your way. Unexpected income. Or someone wasn't paying attention. Someone's not send sending someone a message about something here. It has to do with someone courting someone, something coming someone's way, something positive coming someone's way. A mature man, maybe someone from your past. There's another masculine energy here that is up to no good. This other mature man, it's something having to do with someone courting someone. 
with someone having a gift. Something that's not over for this mature man in regards to someone's occupation. Someone is sending someone a message about this courtship or courting someone. Um, they might take a trip, trip towards someone. Great fortune, someone has a great fortune. Four of Pentacles reverse. Someone doesn't want to let go because they feel like they can get something out of this. Lovers. Imprisonment. Someone feels trapped. They don't want to have legal issues. Or someone doesn't want to go to court. Something about someone wanting a piece of something. Wealthy man. It's like taking something from this wealthy man or not becoming wealthy if they don't hold on to the contract they're trying to someone's trying to hold on to a contract or something but it's like there's money here someone is gonna I feel like someone's being a snake and someone else knows it someone wants to I feel like there is someone that wants to come towards you with genuine feelings This could be someone that threw you under the bus, but their feelings are genuine now, but they've got people around them that are sketchy, that want to hold on to something. Because they feel like if this person moves forward, they're going to do well with you, and some, they don't want to let go of some type of contract. But I also feel like there could be someone else here um, that is either advocating for you or that you're in a relationship with lovers yeah it has something to do with your vision someone who might want to be in a relationship with you because you're a high priestess energy as well not to say that there isn't love there but that they know that you see, you see, you have a very strong third eye. Someone could feel like being with you is the way out of some type of financial hardship as well. Someone lost everything. Or someone who lost everything is watching you move forward in a relationship. Outcome is Knight of Cups. Somebody, there's some sort of romantic gesture here. Someone's in bad health over this, or someone who's in bad health is heading towards someone. Um, lovers. There's some type of relationship here. There's change happening. We have journey under the deck. This is like next to chariot, which feels like a car, a plane, a boat, a trip. It feels like someone traveling towards someone. It feels like a road trip. It feels like um, somebody getting control over their life path. Getting a plan, putting a plan in action. There is, I feel like something about a car ride that's integral to the reading, but I feel like also the chariot and journey is Someone's overall trajectory in love and choice in love. Let's just get, ask a few questions. What's the significance of the child reverse here? Someone lying, wanting to be reject, um, left alone or someone feeling rejected with a child or a child doesn't belong to someone. It doesn't matter if someone's angry or someone's very angry or someone showed their true colors. Someone's very hateful and angry. Someone showed their true colors. Child reverse. Someone's not innocent in a situation. Marriage reverse. This could be someone getting a divorce. Um, 
Someone doesn't care about these fancy things. Someone here is very perseverant. Someone is going to do what they want to do, or someone can't stop someone. It's a nightmare. Suffering. Someone's been persecuted. Someone wanted someone to be rejected. Someone could have persecuted you. Um, someone did something very dishonorable. You see something very clearly. Um, yeah, pride reverse. You see something very clearly. Someone did something very dishonorable. There's some type of uh, ego death here. Someone could feel humiliated or like they... You know, you, you could be very wise. You could have told someone something about a choice here. Um, you could have said to them, um, you know, what you see about a situation and who you, who you are to someone. And, um, there's something about someone being rejected here because of their, um, what they've done. Someone did something dishonorable. They ruined their life. Or they tried to block someone else's fate. It could have to do with someone's ideas. Um, yeah, there's definitely something, maybe someone was stalking someone in the past. Someone could have good memories of you and be realizing that somebody was stalking while you were in a relationship, some sort of third wheel. Um, expectation, the Empress, deep down, you know something. Blessing, reverse. It's like someone didn't fulfill their destiny or they lost a blessing. You're the Empress energy. Um, someone did something here. They feel injured. It has to do with someone making you a promise. You focused on your schedule. You being very organized. Some sort of manipulation not working. Someone feeling overloaded. What's this death here? Some sort of ending. What is? What type of ending is this? Someone's pathway is blocked in their recent past. This has to do with someone's feelings or loss. There's some sort of loss, sorrow, ending, huge blockage in the recent past. It has to do with some type of catastrophe or hateful actions. Um, something to do with someone being very caring towards someone, someone making a choice in love, someone supporting someone, um, someone overindulging in a situation. Um, maybe something's coming into con conclusion around some type of manipulation this feels like a very, a big, big final ending. Um, yeah, very disturbing or disturbed people. Someone who's very lacking in empathy gene. Everything's all for money. Um, someone could feel like they need to need to help. Seven of Cups, Thief Reverse. What is someone trying to figure out here? Seven of Cups, they're trying to figure out something. Someone has positive memories. They want to get rid of this thief. They don't, someone doesn't belong here. Someone ruined, ruined their life. They hate themselves. They need to make a compromise. They lost a gift. They need help. There's a collaboration here that really went awry. Someone feels lonely. Um, yeah, karma's playing out. Um, how can they apologize? This situation is very disturbing. Ace of Cups, something energetic 
Yes, you love yourself, new beginning, self-love, um, new beginning in love, something, someone picking up on the energy. Um, it's, it's karma, it's good karma. Something's playing out for you in the near future. Um, someone is picking up on this. It has to do with a sweet dream um, and, and your goals. And someone feeling lonely here, feeling outcast. The moon, someone could be confused. How did they lose their position? Um, maybe someone felt like they were aligned with you and now they're confused. How did they get so far off track? Or now they're, they're confused because they're unsure how they never saw something. That they lost a blessing. Um, yeah, something that originates with you. Something was authentic. Something was meant to be. Something was... So someone was cultivating something. And now there's all of a sudden these people here who don't belong. And now they're feeling really lonely. It's almost like something was very clear at one point in time. It was right in front of their face. And it was right in front of their face. Something to do with you and something that originates with you. It was th there the whole time. They feel like someone's a thief. Someone doesn't belong here. Someone has been trying to destroy, destroy something that feels anointed or... A blessing and that you were expecting to move forward deep down someone feels like you were always expecting to move forward with them that you knew you felt like you were their counterpart you um, were um, but something about something that you know deep down you're very very wise um, something to do with like a blessing connected to you uh, and this relationship that it's not gonna go the way they think it is if they're trying to take some sort of abundance it doesn't work like that it's it sits with you and there's some sort of expectations you so you were expecting someone or you wanted someone to ri rise to the occasion someone feels like they did something dishonorable Someone's pride it has to do with what you see or what you saw as someone losing a blessing. Something that originates with you, what you're cultivating. It has to do with supporting you as well. Um, it feels like someone feels really confused too. Um, th there's something crushing happening here in the environment. Family room reverse. Some sort of intimate secret is coming out um, and everyone knows it because it's in the environment. What's this Ten of Swords? Someone's crushed, defeated, ruined, some sort of painful ending, um, betrayed, vow reverse. Somebody is um, no longer committed to something they maybe previously committed to. Um, Multiple people could be leaving a situation. There could also have to do something with religion that seems um, off kilter that people are doing that's exposed. Someone lost their dream come true, their wishes. They're not getting their wishes. Somebody could be sick, frail. This could be coming out. Um, something about a third wheel telling telling someone what to do who was sick or someone that was sick this is not an adventure there's a lot of conflict here could it be all coming out someone feels lonely in this collaboration someone feels outcast there could be money problems problems with a home and it has something to do with you being very perseverant as well you have very good ideas you have a strong vision this leads to victory, it's some sort of connection to you persevering versus this group collaboration and some type of vow going awry, some sort of crushing information being made public. You know, how they say don't show your dirty laundry. It's like someone's dirty laundry. 
but it feels like all at once everything's kind of spilling out. Um, someone is worried about someone trying to hold on to something when someone gets gets something, something's working out for someone and someone's worried about security or getting a piece of something here that belongs to someone. When, when a blessing comes in, um, a-okay, you being a-okay, something to do with a, there's some sort of conflict. It's like someone wants someone to go down with them or get a piece of something coming in. Um, it's weird. Something to do with somebody living and learning from a situation, maybe trying to right a wrong. It's got to do with someone feeling trapped or people trying to trap someone. It's like if you go down, we all go down. Or um, it could just be energetic that it's like someone doesn't want, it's like he, the human condition. Someone doesn't want someone to fix their life uh, while, you know, something like that. Or someone trying to hold on. Something could feel dangerous too, like, I mean, if depending if this is more literal, dealing with some evidence and someone could go to jail. It has to do with someone participating in something that um, someone did unapologetically. Um, now they're seeing past some sort of fog about a friendship group. Um, something feels dangerous. Outcome, there's some type of... Um, choice and love here something is changing someone has these romantic feelings and there's a lover's situation here and but then someone's in bad health um someone's has to do with someone someone's mental health treasure is under the deck. So this has something to do with someone not being stressed or someone's mental health. There's change here. We have a treasure under the deck. A lot of watching, stalking, spying, slander. Someone telling people what to do. Someone taking a loss because of it. Um, treasure. Treasure is next to Journey and Chariot. So, there's some sort of abundance here. Someone getting control of a situation. It's connected maybe also to your, your vision. Your inspiration. I feel like someone wants to get themselves away from a third party situation that feels very disturbing. Or there could be someone who's connected to someone, a third party situation that would come across as disturbed to you if you haven't seen them in a while. Um, or someone wants to get control of the situation or you have control over a situation where there's a very disturbed third wheel a lot of it has to do with some sort of blessing or abundance connected to your ideas, your vision, your inspiration. I hope that helps. Um, if, if it resonates, I hope that it helps, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.